Seamus Presenta Oh, you know, just being a diva with my homegirl Linda Dance Extraordinaire The Big Tunes by Jay Elliott While I was in LA, I was staying with my BFF And she had these awesome shoes with jewels on the bottom of it And I was so impressed I was like, who needs Louis Vuittons when you've got DIY, no less Hello So join us on our shameless walk of fame in your boss lady shoes. Let's get started. What you're gonna need are some high heel shoes, be it a pump, a stiletto, a boot, something. But have a little fun. You know what? This is a great activity to do on a girl's night. You're gonna need some rhinestones, some industrial glue. I recommend the E6000 and a syringe if you can. This is just gonna make it easier to work with the tiny little rhinestones. Then you're gonna need a workstation. Just put down some sort of plastic or newspaper because you don't wanna ruin the surface you're gonna be working on, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna take your jewels and create a design, a pattern, and Linda here is doing it on the paper. So this is gonna make things go a lot faster and quicker when you actually start gluing them onto your shoe. See, I couldn't decide, so I have three different designs and I end up going with this third one. So this is what it looks like. Fun, you can use as many colors as you want. You don't even have to use rhinestones. You can see here I've incorporated the edge as part of the design. So you can cover the whole thing completely so there's no sole showing. Um, I was kind of inspired by flowers. So what you're gonna do is take the E6000 glue, squeeze it into the syringe, and you see that? It makes it so much easier. Of course, you don't need to do that, but it is recommended. And, you know, just fiddle. As per Linda's recommendation, it's a good idea to start the design of the sole from the center and work your way out. This creates symmetry, but of course if you want asymmetrical things, you don't have to do that. And this is Linda's design. See, she's she's trying to figure it out. <laughs> so it's like a it's like a jigsaw puzzle. Play around, glue it. Linda puts the glue on the actual shoe and spat out. Put that rhinestone down, boo. Voila! Now to paint the town and be shameless, yo. Ladies night, uh, uh, ladies night. Let we go, let we go, let we go, let we go. Thank you, Linda, for sharing your awesome creativity with us. Barumba by J. Elliot Son. Okay, booze, if you plan on doing this, make sure you tag me, Maya's World, or use my hashtag, ShamelessMaya, so I can see it. And in the comment section, just let me know what color shoes you have and what color gem or material you plan on putting underneath your shoe. I want to know. Comment below. That's it. Shout out to Dwayne for manning the camera. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, yo. So why, what's the story with the shoes? We're gonna glue some like rhinestones, but um, at, at the end I'm gonna get Linda to dance. He's like, leave me alone. <laughs> Are blind. That's what you call blind blind. <laughs> Unless should I mix it up with green? It's the red and the blue. blue. <laughs> I think I might get the champagne in the bigger pack. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>